Yes guys, once again this is Assorted Challenge TV and welcome back to our YouTube channel. Number 5 Challenger 2 United Kingdom Tank The FV4034 Challenger 2 is a British main battle tank, MBT, in service with the armies of the United Kingdom and Oman. It was designed and built by the British company Vickers Defence Systems, now known as B Systems Land and Armaments. The Challenger 2 is an extensive redesign of the Challenger 1. Although the hull and automotive components seem similar, they are of a newer design and build than those of the Challenger 1 and only around 3% of components are interchangeable. The Challenger 2 is equipped with a 120mm, 4.7 in, 55 caliber long L30A1 tank gun, the successor to the L11 gun used on the Chieftain and Challenger 1. Unique among NATO main battle tank armament, the L30A1 is rifled, because the British Army continues to place a premium on the use of high explosive squash head HESH, rounds in addition to armor-piercing fin stabilized discarding sabot rounds. The Challenger 2 is also armed with the L94A1 EX34 7.62mm chain gun and a 7.62mm L37A2 GPMG machine gun. 50 main armament rounds and 4,200 rounds of 7.62 mm ammunition are carried. Number 4 America's Abrams Tank The M1 Abrams is an American third-generation main battle tank. It is named after General Creighton Abrams. Highly mobile, designed for modern armored ground warfare, the M1 is well armed and heavily armored. Notable features include the use of a powerful multi-fuel turbine engine, the adoption of sophisticated composite armor, and separate ammunition storage in a blowout compartment for crew safety. Weighing nearly 68 short tons, almost 62 metric tons, it is one of the heaviest main battle tanks in service. Three main versions of the M1 Abrams have been deployed, the M1, M1A1, and M1A2, incorporating improved armament, protection, and electronics. The main armament of the original model M1 was the M68A1 105mm rifled tank gun firing a variety of high explosive anti-tank, high explosive, white phosphorus and an anti-personnel, multiple flechette, round. This gun used a license made tube of the British Royal Ordnance L7 gun together with the vertical sliding breech block and other parts of the American T254 E2 prototype gun. However, it proved to be inadequate, a cannon with lethality beyond the 1.9 mile 3 km range was needed to combat newer armor technologies. To attain that lethality, the projectile diameter needed to be increased. The main armament of the M1A1 and M1A2 is the M256A1 120mm smoothbore gun, designed by Rheumatol AG of Germany, manufactured under license in the US by Water Light Arsenal New York. The M256A1 is a variant of the Rheumatol 120mm L-44 gun carried on the German Leopard 2 on all variants up to the Leopard 2A5. 
Leopard 2A6 replaced the L-44 barrel with a longer L-55. Number 3 K-2 Black Panther South Korea Tank The K-2 Black Panther is a South Korean main battle tank that will replace most of the M48 pattern tanks and complement the K-1 series of main battle tanks currently fielded by the Republic of Korea. Mass production commenced in 2013 and the first K-2S were deployed with the armed forces in June 2014. The K-2 costs over 8.5 million US dollars per unit. The Black Panther is armed with a 120mm L-55 smoothbore gun indigenously developed by High and Iwear. This is complemented by an auto-loader, similar to that designed for the Leclerc tank, it can fire up to 10 rounds a minute. The ammunition for the main gun is loaded in a 16-shell magazine. The tank has a total ammunition capacity of 40 rounds for its main armament. Secondary weapons include a 12.7mm K6 heavy machine gun and a 7.62mm coaxial machine gun. The K2 is equipped with an advanced fire control system, FCS, linked to an extremely high frequency radar system deployed on the frontal arc of the turret along with a traditional laser rangefinder and crosswind sensor. The system is capable of a lock-on mode, which can acquire and track specific targets up to a range of 9.8 km miles, using a thermographic camera. This allows the crew to fire accurately while moving as well as engage low-flying aircraft. Number 2 Leopard 2 Germany Tank The Leopard 2 is a main battle tank developed by Krauss Maffei in the 1970s for the West German Army. The tank first entered service in 1979 and succeeded the earlier Leopard 1 as the main battle tank of the German army. It is armed with a 120mm smoothbore cannon, and is powered by a V12 twin turbo diesel engine. The primary armament for production versions of the Leopard 2 is the Metal 120mm smoothbore gun, the same gun currently used on the M1 Abrams, in either the L-44 variant, found on all production Leopard 2s until the A5, or the L-55 variant, as found on the Leopard 2 A6 and subsequent models. Ammunition for the gun comprises 27 rounds stored in a special magazine in the forward section of the hull, to the left of the driver's station, with an additional 15 rounds stored in the left side of the turret bustle, which are separated from the fighting compartment by an electrically operated door. If the ammunition storage area is hit, a blow-off panel in the turret roof would direct an explosion upwards away from the crew compartment. 
The gun is fully stabilized, and can fire a variety of types of rounds, such as the German DM-43 Jepst anti-tank round, which is said to be able to penetrate 560 mm in, of steel armor at a range of 2,000 m yards, and the German DM-12 multipurpose anti-tank projectile, MP-18. Number 1 T-14 Armata Russian Tank The T-14 Armata is a Russian main battle tank based on the Armata Universal Combat Platform. It is the first series produced next generation tank. The Russian army planned to acquire 2,300 T-14s in the period 2015 to 2020 but production and fiscal shortfalls will restrict the number built to just 100 by 2020. The first batch of T-14 armored tanks will be deployed to the Tumun division after 2020, tanks will be transferred only after the completion of all state tests. The main armament of the T-14 is the 2A82-1M 125mm, 4.92-in, smoothbore cannon, a replacement for the 2A46 125mm gun of previous Russian and Soviet tanks. Its muzzle energy is greater than one of the world's previously considered best cannons, the German Leopard 2 Metal 120mm gun. The 125mm gun has 15-20% to improved accuracy and its rolling fire angular dispersion has improved 1.7 times. Features include an absence of a fume extractor, due to the unmanned turret, a firing rate of 10-12 to 12 revolutions per minute, rounds per minute, left side casing ejection port for the 125mm gun and a maximum effective penetration range of 8km with 80 gems. The detection range of the tank's optical sensors is more than 5km for tank-sized targets in daylight, and at least 3.5km at night through the thermal imaging channel. The gunner sight's optical channel is equipped with 4 times and 12 times optical zoom. The laser range finder has a theoretical maximum range of 7.5 km. These systems are duplicated, in addition there is a weaker third system that can fire on the move. The crew uses a high definition camera with a 360 degree field, 